Welcome to Strangely Accepted, where I tell short stories about moments in my life where I felt completely accepted for who I am with all my weirdness and my strangeness and my quirks. Today specifically, I want to talk about a moment I shared with my dad. And this memory came to me today when I was teaching. Uh, we were talking about the uh, complicated nature of family relationships and how they grow over time and I decided to tell them this story where um, I was teaching at a different school a couple of years ago and I had an idea. My dad always says that when I say those four words that that's his worst nightmare. Uh, hopefully he's joking. <laughs> um, but he does always know that it's gonna be a wild ride and an adventure whenever I say those four words, I have an idea. So in this particular instance, I had an idea for a costume. So I call him up and he says, hey, like, aren't you at work? I'm like, yeah, I'm at work, but I had an idea. He chuckles and he says, okay, all right, what's up? And all I say to him, I provide no context whatsoever, is I need a skull. And without even flinching, no reaction, no questions, he just says, how big? I'm like, so I start describing the size of the skull that I need. And he's like, oh, okay, I think I know a guy. I'll get back to you. And he hangs up the phone. And that's it. The end of the conversation, he didn't ask any questions. And that moment was one of the clearest moments that I remember where my dad just was like, yep, that's Emily. She's got some crazy idea. I'll find out about it later, I'm sure. For now, I'm just gonna help her find a skull somewhere. So yeah, that's a, a moment when I felt strangely accepted.